the St. Ledger Trialist Nexus is a three year old event over a mile and three quarters. And at the top, we've got Crawler for Martin Needham, Crystal Clear, Obi Wan, Color Hill, Jacko for Satyam, Devilish Gildin, Darren Thompson, El Paso Morant for Vinny Gerard, F. Scott Fitzgerald for Paul Rhodes, Late Arrival for Craig Allen, Tim Burrow and McGrew for Matt Cooper, Trent Manor for Darren, not Darren, David Robertson, Alarming for John Morgan, Drums in the Deeply on Van Rensburg, High Top Jim Murray, Lakota Sally. Padre Hogan, Poppets Path, Dan Hughes, So Alive, Craig Beckwith, Stick Quid, Thomas Rogers, and Swoop for Joshua Sutherland. So 17 runners in it then. And quietly installed and ready to go, and away they go. And a devilish gelding was out pretty quickly. It's rather early in the season for a St. Ledger trot, but it'll give us a bit of an idea. By the Queen's Vase in a few weeks, but it's crystal clear in the lead. And it's gone across to that rail. Obi Wan leading by two to F. Scott Fitzgerald in second. That's a bit of a bit of a mouthful to say. Quickly that F. Scott Fitzgerald. Shouldn't be really easy to say, but it just doesn't roll off at all that well. Anyway, Crystal clears in the lead by about four. To High Top Town in second, then F. Scott Fitzgerald is after that one. Then Swoop and Crawler in the stripes with the yellow jacket of Colour Hill Jacko on the outside of Devilish Gildin. Hope he isn't a gelding, otherwise, he won't be allowed to run at the same ledger. Uh, Poppet's Path is after that one, and then comes So Alive and El Paso Morant with late arrival. Next, Trey Manor is on the outside. And it's Crystal Clear, who's clearing the lead at the moment, with nine furlongs still to go. Swoop is just second in the black and red hoops on the outside of the black with the red sleeves of High Town Top, and then Crawler in the Purple and white stripes. F. Scott Fitzgerald is on the inside in the orange with the white sleeves. Then comes Poppet's Path in the blue with the yellow jacket of Cully El Jacko. And El Paso Morant in the shades of green closest to us with behind that one the white sleeves and the blue jacket of So Alive. Tracking that one is Trema Nor for David Robertson. The turquoise and mauve hoops right over on the far right and the green and the yellow. And Craig Allen's late arrival. Drums in the deep for Leon in the navy blue with a gold cap. Next to that one, we have Lakota Sally. Also, there, one of those two Lakota Sally and Cully Old Jacko. One of them is Satyams and one of them's Padregs. I was getting mixed up, so we'll see. Alarming is in the middle of the pack for John Morgan and his new colours. But they describe them really black, sort of maroon sleeves and a bit of a Target or something, I don't know if you want to explain to us what they are. More American type silks than British ones. Looking towards the back, Timboro and McGrew is towards the back with Stick Quid, but they're already down there inside the final two and a half furlongs. And Poppet's Path has gone a length clear of Swoop in second, Drums in the Deep is in third. Then comes uh, Larmin, he's with El Paso Morant. F. Scott Fitzgerald is going to try and run along the rail. Crawler is one of the ones that's dropped out of it, so too's High Top Town. But it's Poppet's Path who's in the lead. Poppet's Path in, who's in front, and then we just lose a little bit of video clarity there. But it's Poppet's Path in the lead. Alarming there comes through to challenge. So too does El Paso Morant there, well inside the final half. Well, and it's going to be Alarming. I think he's going to take this one. It's another one for John Morgan. Alarming takes it from El Paso Morant, and then Swoop and Trey Manor and Devilish Gelding ran on then. And all the way back to the long time leader, Crystal Clear, who was probably just last. Alarming, took that on with a little bit of jerky video at my end. I don't know whether we like it your end. It's alarming that takes it for John Morgan. El Paso Morant, Vinny Gerard second. Swoop for Joshua Sutherland was third. Trey Manor for David Robertson was fourth. And Poppet's Path for Dan Hughes was fifth. <laughs>